Welcome to Reading Rugby Club. Here we have our clubhouse, our grounds around here. But unfortunately, we've not got any people. The pandemic has hit us really hard in that every weekend we'd have our seniors, men's and women's, all playing on Saturdays. And on a Sunday morning, 300 to 350 kids all playing rugby from ages of four right through to 18. At the moment, we've got nobody. So we're not able to use the clubhouse. The changing rooms are all empty. It's quiet. I love rugby at Weatherby. Weatherby is the first place that I've really fallen in love with playing playing rugby. It means everything to me. It's all about friendship um, and joining together for a love of rugby. Weatherby is a club that is loved by people from three years old to 93 years old. I've played here at Weatherby Rugby Club all my life. It's just fantastic. We love you, Weatherby. Yeah, Weatherby. I've played rugby there since I was 12 years old. I've never got any better. Just one big Crackers family. Such a community. You're not just a team in isolation. You get to eat hot dogs at the end and also um, you get to see your friends. I couldn't be more proud to be chairman at Weatherby Rugby Club. What I think makes Weatherby a special place is when there's a job to be done at Weatherby, it's the club members that do it, whether that be a work day that we do in the off season or something as big as redesigning and renovating the clubhouse, which is happening currently. Weatherby Rugby Club means a lot to us because it gives our kids a load of fun, a load of exercise, and the clubhouse really is icing on the cake. For the under 10s, the clubhouse is the heart of our rugby family. Here's what some of the squad think. Friendship. I'm tasting it. <gasps> Fitness and cheesy chips. After a hard session, I can meet up with my friends over a sausage sandwich and a beer or two. It's always good to come back after a game to into the clubhouse and have a nice laugh with my friends. The clubhouse is a great place to watch international games with friends and family. I can't think of a bad time that I've had, uh, certainly in the clubhouse. And whether you win or lose, you're with friends, you're with family, you're with brothers, you're with mates. Whether we rugby clubs, uh, such a heart of the community. We're such a family club. Um, I've played for the club, I've played in the vets, um, and both boys here have played for the club as well. Like many families, loads of people, uh, right through the generations. One particular person who unfortunately can't be with us is Richard Jones. The Jones family has been right at the heart of Weatherby, right from the start of the club, from his dad Mel through to Richard. Uh, Richard's going to be really, really sorely missed. Um, what a fantastic guy, uh, great player in his time, and has been a superb coach. And he got everybody involved in rugby. Um, I played alongside of him. I've coached with him, coached my brother's age group with him. And he was my coach since I was five and he was a brilliant coach and I'm going to really miss him. Here we've got the project started by Richard. Um, this was his passion, he really wanted to get this back to uh, the feeling that we had in the old clubhouse when it was a real social hive and, and after every game um, it was a great place to just come and have a beer and we haven't managed to finish it and I know Richard would really appreciate all of your support if you could make a donation so that we can get this all complete so when we're allowed to come back and start rugby up again we've got a clubhouse everybody's going to be proud of. Thanks. <laughs>